Hi there. So uh, looking on your post and seeing that you were having more pain during pregnancy and uh, made me think of this technique that I use for reducing pain for myself and also some people that I that I know. Um, but I wanted to see if it might make a difference for you because one of the things is that our body um, has a lot of chemistry going on all the time and I'm sure during pregnancy it's even more. Um, but we can also sometimes influence that chemistry and that's what this is about if you're interested. Um, it comes from a book by Candace Burt called Molecules of Emotion and it talks about these molecules that we produce based on um, just the way that we are consciously um, present um, in the world. We produce these peptides and then they change the function of our body. There's also a book by Bruce Lipton called The Biology of Belief in which he talks about how these instructions that go to our cells really influence the function of the cells. And then um, I read this book, been interested in this stuff for quite a long time, by Frank Kinzel's Secret of Instant Healing. And he has this little technique that I think is, is helping us to change our chemistry. So if you're interested, I invite you to give this a try. And uh, if you feel any different, uh, please to let me know. But when we're stressed, um, the cells of our body are reacting to that stress, to what's in the outside world and it takes a lot of the cell's energy. And if we can um, move into a state where we're not reacting to what's going on, that the cells of our body don't have to, we can still think about it, but if the cells of our body can move into a non-reactive state, we're changing the chemistry. And um, in my experience, I've experienced it, that helps me to feel better, and some other people I know have also experienced uh, results with this. So feel welcome to try it if you want. In order to get into that different state, I'm going to invite you just to look at a single point. Because when you look at a single point, it could be any point um, just off the screen in your room or wherever you're at, you're actually, with the focus of your mind, because it's a simple thing, your emotion is changing because you are putting your attention in a single point. And when your emotion is changing, the chemistry in your uh, mind is changing and then the instructions to your body are changing. So do that for just a second. You don't need to look at me. If you drift off it, just bring your attention back to it. And then when you're ready, I'm going to invite you to pick a second point and observe that. It could be uh, something on the wall, a corner of a window, um, part of a chair. Pick a single point and just observe that for a second. Again, a very simple thing to do. And as you do this, the chemistry in your body is changing. Don't know what effect it'll have on um, kind of how you're feeling, but um, this is an exercise in which you're actually gaining some influence over the chemistry that's going on in your body just by changing what we're focusing on. Now, when you're ready, if you observe that between those two points is an empty space, behind it's the wall or whatever, but between any two points, you can use any two points anywhere, there's a space that has nothing in it. And if you observe that space that has nothing in it, then with your conscious mind you're observing nothing. And when your mind observes that there's nothing out in the outside world, it actually gives the cells of your body a really important signal that there's nothing they need to do in the outside world for you right now. And when I observe this space, um, I just feel this subtle but clear relaxing feeling that goes on a lowering in my chest. Um, some people that I've done this with uh, they feel a tingling or their shoulders uh, relax or their neck loosens up. Different people feel different things. But I invite you, um, if you try it, to observe one point, a little bit later a second point, space in between that has nothing in it. And then you are, um, based on these books that I was just mentioning, Candace Pert, Bruce Lipton, and Frank Kinslow, actually creating a different chemistry for your body. And since we are um, a lot of chemistry, you know, the food we eat, the medications we take, here's a way to add to that chemical mix. And it's possible that if you do this, you might feel um, a difference in the way that um, you're experiencing your pain. Don't know what will happen for you. Um, it's something I use all the time in my life and for the past couple of years. I um, invite you to check it out. If it does make any difference, drop me a note back. I'd be very interested to hear if um, it makes any difference for you, too. All right, thanks a lot, and all the best wishes uh, with your pregnancy, with having that pain reduce, um, and bringing a wonderful baby into the world.
All right. Take care. Bye.